Hey, 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 what's up, what's down, guys? It is the Money in this once again, and today I finally did it. Yes, that is right, I finally did it. That is right, I unlocked all the possible reticles for the sniper rifle. I did the default, the crosshead, the pinpoint, the one breath, hangman, drop angle, circle pit, cover shot, top notch, marksman, grid line, and last to finally critical. And boy, was it a challenge. I mean, look at this. 500 kills with any sniper scope, 150 mounted kills, and all these other challenges are just kind of ridiculous. But in the end, I think it's kind of worth it. And I'll show you guys why. This is probably one of the most clearest optic out there. Yes, it has a downside. Its downside is the sniper glint or the optic glint. And I think this thing has an upside and a downside. The downside is people know where you're at. The upside, people know where you're at. Because people think you're using a sniper rifle when you use this thing and people freak out like crazy or they try to take you out as fast as possible which gets them to do reckless maneuvers and you will most likely win because they panic too much the ADS speed is not that bad if you really think about it it's not and I'll show you once I get this thing in warzone so we're gonna go and take this thing into warzone battle royale solos and I'll go ahead and show you how it works all right well if I said battle royale solos well I kind of lied I accidentally meant to say quads plunder but what about the quads? Yes, we're gonna go for at least 10 kills with this setup. I mean, just look at the ADS speed. It's not even that bad. I'm using the 60 round mag monolithic suppressor and the 16, I mean, and the 19 inch barrel. It's not even that bad of an ADS speed. It's a 3x by default and it's a 6.1 for zoomed in. So it's not really bad. I'd say it's actually pretty good. And I think I'm actually gonna use this thing um, more than the other optics. What was that? The 3X Hybrid? Yeah, I'm gonna use this thing more than the 3X Hybrid. Just because it's so nice and clear. Just look at that little blue dot. Second, like I'm killing everybody, but I'm not actually killing them. Let's try it again. What? Oh yeah, there we go. Let's see, did we get a glint? Yeah, we got a glint. Who blocked him? And now I can't find anybody to kill. Spoken too soon. Can we please get five more kills? Hey, you know what? Let's just go over here. Got him. Here, you know what? Let's get out of this place. Really? Watch this. Get teamed! Alright, that was probably a good example for an open field combat. If you could laser someone. That was another good example. Now, where's everybody else? Oh good, they're over here. Nope. Whoa, no! Oh yeah, get teamed. Yes! We made the 10th kill! We good. Oh man, we didn't even get the 10th kill. Oh well, it's close enough. We'll count the supply box as a kill. Alright guys, so that's where we're going to go ahead and end it today. And let me know what you guys think of the variable zoom scope. Is it pretty viable? Do you think it's pretty good? And will you guys give it a try? Please leave your answers in the comment section down below. And we're going to go ahead and wrap today's video up with a goodbye.